Hey everybody, welcome to JLB Sports TV. I am Justin Block and today I have a very special announcement. Today I'm announcing the launch of JLBSports.TV, a website that's been in the making for quite some time, even though I didn't tell you guys at all. Depending on how long you've been following me, you would know that I actually used to do a lot of sports writing. Um, as far back as seventh grade, I was sports blogging mainly about the NFL and uh, Major League Baseball and the Green Bay Packers and New York Yankees. Um, when high school rolled around, I decided Hey, it takes a long time to write these articles. I have a lot of homework. Why don't just make videos? Thus, JLB Sports TV was born. But I decided to make a return to writing this summer in an effort to, um, I don't know, occupy my time. I don't have a job this summer. And I'm treating this site, this YouTube channel, and my other site as my jobs this summer. So if you look behind me, there's the beautiful JLBSports.TV. It just launched today. And it's going to be covering mainly sports and pop culture. If you're familiar with the site Grantland.com, it's in that same vein. There's going to be a lot of sports features, plenty of columns, uh, lots of deep, insightful analysis. And there's going to be some pop culture. I watch TV. I go to the movies. You know, I'm a consumer of pop culture, and I have an opinion on things. So why not throw that up there, too? Right now, I have three articles up. There's one article on how um, hip-hop branding principles have sort of recreated the Brooklyn Nets. The Nets basketball franchise just moved to Brooklyn. They're trying to get a new vibe. Um, they're sort of remaking themselves and they're using hip hop to uh, do that. So I have an article on that. I have another article that I'm sure um, all my soccer, I mean football followers on this channel would like. I talk about why the Netherlands crashed out of Euros 2012 in the way that they did. And I talk about how people should have actually expected this because in my opinion, there are, the Iran Hay were kind of overrated coming into the tournament. And um, their demise should really not surprise anybody. So I talk about that. I also have another article on HBO's new series, The Newsroom. I don't know um, how many people overseas, all my European followers are familiar with HBO or keep up with the shows, but um, check that out if you do. It's a highly anticipated, highly criticized series that I kind of uh, hashed out and make sense of. So I just wanted to make that announcement, but do not worry, this channel will not be neglected whatsoever. I'm still gonna be talking plenty of Liverpool, plenty of football, gonna do my match reviews. Um, Gonna do my match previews, gonna just talk Liverpool all the time on this channel, European football all the time, and that will not take away from anything I do there, and vice versa. I'm not gonna be posting um, match reviews or match recaps much on JLB Sports TV, uh, I mean JLB Sports TV. Um, at least at this point, I don't anticipate doing that much because I'm trying to work toward a more universal, uh, wider audience with that website. So this channel will have feature a lot of me um, talking Liverpool, doing match reviews. <clears throat> Those videos will be featured on the site. When I do talk about Liverpool on the site, they're gonna be more uh, broader points, they're gonna be more universal. Um, they're not gonna be, you know, the individual match reviews per se. So please come by and check out the new least, newly launched JLBSports.TV. Come support, come read what I've written. Be sure to follow the new website account on Twitter, at JLBSportsTV49, as well as me, as me of course, um, at JBlock49. Come support the site, um, keep supporting the YouTube channel. I have plenty more videos, plenty more writings on the site. This is all I'm doing all summer, so expect lots of new content, and um, YMWA, guys.